right now we're going to talk about paying for college. A highly recommended way to pay for college is to save money over time to help pay for it. So your best plan is to start saving when a child is born. So I have twins on the way due in January. So I got to start thinking about saving for college for them now. So I can have enough money to pay for both of them to go to college when they are 18. Or whatever they choose to do if it's not college. Putting in a little bit of money often will grow over time. And it won't seem as overwhelming if you're putting in a little bit of money often as opposed to having to pay that huge chunk of money when that first tuition comes around. All right, then we have grants. Students can apply for a grant for multiple reasons. A student does not have to pay the grant back. So this is different from a loan. You do not have to pay this back. Um, so you can apply to get a grant. Scholarships are usually awarded for grades or some kind of achievement. So you can apply for, for um, scholarships when you're applying for college. The student has to apply for the scholarship and does not have to pay it back. So these are all great options because you do not have to pay it back. What's important though is you need to spend this money on your college expenses. They're not just for fun play money. All right, the thing we dread the most, student loans. It's a money a student can borrow from a lender. And it usually has an interest rate. So what that means is they're going to charge you extra for borrowing that money. So you're actually going to end up paying back more than you borrowed. Um, you must pay it back. And it's usually over a course of 20 years. You can pay it back, of course, quicker than that. But usually it is over a baseline of 20 years. Sometimes loans can be forgiven for different reasons. That means that you don't have to pay it back. Um, some of those reasons could be for being a police officer, um, some kind of public service worker. Some teachers do get loans forgiven um, depending on what school they work in. Um, so there are just some options to get some loans forgiven, usually not all of your loans, but some of them. And then another option is work study. So this is a part-time or full-time job for students that are in financial need, allowing them to earn money to pay for educational expenses. So usually they'll have some kind of job at the college they go to to help pay for their educational expenses. I actually had a roommate that did work study. All right, thank you so much for watching.